Hi, everybody. James Sabolski along with Ray Ferraro for EA Sports. It's the home opener and definitely a buzz in the building here tonight. Yeah, you can just feel the buzz in this city all day long, and we are seconds away now for this opening face-off. The Admirals take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. The Chefs move it in. British Columbia's got the puck along the wall. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Centering feed, and that doesn't go as it's off the stick. Across the point. along the wall by Chikrin. Oh, that was violent. That's a big hit, and it jars you right to the core when you get hit like that. Scooped up along the wall by Phillips. Aaron pass, and they can't connect. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Phillips. Rips it. Chance and it goes sideways. They go on the attack through center. Here's a shot. Oh, what a slick stop by Bennington. Oh, they couldn't connect on the play. Takes the puck. Don't sit back. You're not defending the lead with way too much time left. Icing is the call. We're going to face off at the other end. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. 1-0 the score. The Admirals win it in the defensive zone. Simple detail. Win the draw. You can get out of the zone. Oh, you know, as a rookie, you're dreaming about your first goal. He doesn't have one yet, but he's got the puck in the offensive zone. Here's a blast, and it comes up with the save. British Columbia's got the puck along the boards. And he makes the save on that play. Scrum and Sue's along the boards. British Columbia's got it from behind the net. Taken by Crawl. Takes the feed. The Admirals get a hold of the puck in their own end. Korshak stick handling in his own zone. Now over to Semenov. Oh, and he blocked him. I've been hit like that. You look up, there's nowhere to go, and you've got to take the hit. Stones him in front. Julio is able to stay in the play after he stumbles. Still gets the shot. That's a terrific effort. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Picks up the puck in his own end. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Calvary's got a hold of the puck now. Quick feed to Semenov. Handles the puck. Stays with it. Oh, the officials were all over that trip. And the players whistle dead. Here's the call. Chick Green's a star defender on his team's blue line. McCarr's a solid defender, but he can still throw a point for his puck. I'll be watching these two players to see if one of them can really shine for their team's best. Guys, that's you. Calvary's in possession along the boards. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Yeah, he's a sharp save, James. Right in the middle of the ice, he makes the stop and pushes it away. Here's a short pass to Peterson. And a little physical there with that collision. And makes the routine save. 
trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. The Admiral scooping up along the boards. The Chefs get a hold of the puck. Oh, he made a solid hit on him there. He was waiting for it and laid the shoulder. Oh, oh, oh. And they score! Oh. With the delayed penalty, everybody falls back on their heels a bit. They don't defend well, and it's in their net. Calgary's had this game circled on the calendar for a while, and they came ready. You can circle it, you can think about it, but then you got to execute. This has been a fantastic start. Takes the feed. Oh, and that goes off target. I mean, he works into position to, to get this spot on the ice. It's a good scoring spot, but he misses the net. He's got to at least test the goal. Moves it to Melanson. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Stevens. Couldn't make the connection on the play. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Calgary's on the attack. And he slides it quickly to Veselainen. And he was ready for that one. Bennington's coming off a shutout in his last start while he's trailing in this game. That's a pretty good save there. Handles the pass. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. There's another great save! In tight, he had to make an excellent save. Veselainen's moving the puck through his own zone. A little back and forth. Time running out with this man advantage. Here we go. Break away! Oh, no! Stop between the pipes! He is dialing! He really is, James. The shooter's in a position to deliver the puck to either side of the net. And it's like the goalie has got everything smart. He's right on it. Knocked around, but keeps it going. Penalty has expired. Both sides back to even strength. Well, the penalty killers can go back to the bench knowing they did their job. Score remains the same as it... He's got a step! the score. Just here in the late stages of this frame, British Columbia is trailing by one. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. And officials right on top of that one, calling for a slashing penalty, it looks like. Here's the chance to set up now. And he slides it quickly to Hedrington. Sends the pass over. And that slides right out to center ice. Looks to pass it to Hetherington. Puck picked up by Zarek. Grabs control of it at the point. The Admiral is taken along the wall. Grabs possession of the puck. Rips it from the blue line. Denies the shooter on that play. Shot and it misses wide. Moves it quickly over to Zeri. Looks to set up at the point now. And that'll put a bow on the first 20 minutes of action here tonight. We've got lots more still to come. Second period is just around the corner. Peterson's not going to be able to return to the game. Just got word from the PR department. He's out for the night. All right, thanks very much for the update, Mr. Ferraro. And we'll see how things are impacted here with the line juggling going forward. Quick pass to Beckman. Sarri's loving the puck. Here they come on the attack. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. 
zone. Made the stop on the play. British Columbia is down against the boards. The Admirals carried along the wall. And he takes the feed. British Columbia's got the puck against the half wall. Hammers one. Stops it cold. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. This game weighs heavy on the penalty killer's shoulders now. They're down a goal, but they have to keep it right there as they're short a player now. Here's that 1 3 1 set again, James. We've seen it before. The key is that you get movement once you're set up. Once you get possession, the net part has to be taken care of. And that's when you create the chance. Quick feed to Hedrington. The Chefs will play the puck from the back of the net. Piece of a jolt with that hit. The Chefs get a hold of the puck along the boards. And that's broken up. Taken by Veselainen. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Play is blown dead with the offside. McCarr has been looking for a way off the ice for a little bit of time on this ship. He was injured somewhere in the midst of it. He wants to get off the ice. Chance to reset here on the draw on this man advantage. The Chefs win possession here in the open ice. Slides the puck over. Trying to connect the pass, but it doesn't go. And they move the puck out of harm's way. Receives the pass. Surprise, surprise, surprise. This fan base uh, is not exactly a fan of the call, right? No, you can hear the frustration. They've had it with the official. And the players are losing it, too. British Columbia's got a possession here. Zone moving the puck along the side. Slides it over with pace to Hayek. Morrison's been slashed. Penalty coming up. Here's the official call. Penalty killers better be sharp here, James. I mean, you're protecting that one goal lead, and now you're shorthanded. The Admirals once again send out their power play unit. I would say the four-on-three is more of a shooting power play. Now that they've taken that penalty and they go down with just the one man advantage, you've got to get the puck into a shooting spot and deliver it to the net. You can't do that to the Stars. Yeah, even if you think it's a clean hit, and I do, it doesn't matter. Somebody's coming after you. And takes it down with authority. The Heat was in control of his boat from the get-go and takes him down to finish it off. The Admirals would like to add on to the momentum gained with that fight. The building is really perked up. We're still in the early stages of this period. It's 2-1. British Columbia's got it in the offensive zone. Pretty hard to have a more low-intensity power play than that. They really didn't generate a thing, and when you don't generate much, you're sure not going to score. The Admirals gain possession along the wall. Beckman's got it against the boards. Trying to right to the front. A bad break hits the post and stays out. British Columbia's got it in the neutral zone. Takes the hit on the play. Takes the cross ice pass. Fires it on net. And that doesn't reach the net. Melanson's got it in the offensive end. British Columbia's got a hold of it against the wall. Here they come. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. He 
bails his guys out again. I mean, he probably could use a little help. The guy's standing right in the middle of the ice to shoot this puck, but he tracks it and makes a really good save. Tulio's ready to go. The transition game now into full effect as they move across the blue line. Man advantage unit comes up empty-handed, and they're still trailing by the goal. Steps out behind it at the play of the puck. British Columbia's got it in their own zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Here's an offensive chance. some treatment here. He's not doing so great. And he puts that one aside with ease. Calgary's got the puck along the wall. British Columbia's gained possession. And takes a turn out of the offensive end to find some space at center. Moves the puck along the half wall. Denied by the defender. And he takes 
the pass. Time to execute here on this power play. And he sends it across to Nemestikov. Poked away in the neutral zone by Hyatt. With possession along the wall. And now it's grabbed by Harrington. Panthers are going to the blue line. And that backs off a step. Both teams are now back to even strength as the power play has expired. Obviously a pretty important time in the game. The PK does a good job. Keeps this game tied. Calgary's through center and now in the offensive end. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. British Columbia's got it in their own zone. Puck scooped up by Bourgeau. Great balance as he scoops it back up. There's the whistle icing the call. Big face off looming. Steven slowly skating around after he blocked that shot. I gotta tell you, there's another reminder of why I didn't do that. Here in the later stages of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Borchos won the face off. British Columbia is moving it along the wing. The Admirals play it along the wing. Sends the cross ice pass. Slip feed. Broken up with the stick at the defensive end. Whoa! Try to calm down now as you set up for the face-off? Absolutely. You can't stop thinking about the fact you just scored your first goal. Time to drop. Play resumes. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And there's the save. Pinned up along the boards. Back to the blue line.
British Columbia's got it along the wall. And that's a smart heads up play. is the call. Lots of time left in this period. We are all tied up in this one. And momentum on their side as they win the... zone face-off. That shouldn't have been an icing call. That's a poor pass that penalizes them to come back to the zone. Face-off win, shot on the board. The Admirals are up by one here in the third. This is not the time for prevent, though, is it? It's way too early for that. Get after it. Four check. Press the play. That's the way you defend. The draw, the wise but about to drop the puck. Phillips has won the draw. Hammers the shot. Misses over the net. Takes the puck at the point. Takes it along the wall by Beckman. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Puck grab by McCall. Can't make it work. Calgary's got possession here in the neutral zone. And that's broken up. Calgary's got the puck against the boards. Takes it to the net. And a huge stop by the goaltender at point blank range. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up, spreads out, and makes the save. And that's blocked in traffic. Takes the feed. Here's the chance. the goal for but James, it doesn't bounce for them. They still trail in the game. Quick pass to Seminole. The Chefs cross the line and gain the zone. Puck picked up by Bourgeau. Picked up along the board by Vincent Oh, another 
the ref did not like that. Let's see what the officials say. Maybe just the touch over aggressive here as they try to get the equalizer, but now they got to kill a penalty. Another power play opportunity coming up here. That's throws part of this power play away. A penalty takes them down to a four on three. Oh, what a stop! Calgary's got him along the wall. Great reach with the poke check by Morrison. From center, they get into the attacking area. Power play is over. Both teams back to even strength. Well, there are times you look for your power play, at the very least, to gain a little momentum. They needed a goal. Now they still trail by one back to even strength. This is not an easy one. Right from the middle of the ice. Still lots of time left in the period. British Columbia is clinging to this 4-3 lead. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Oh, what an effort giving up the body there. Quick feed from a car. Takes that pass back to the corner. on the play. Centers are lined up and we are ready to resume. British Columbia has won the face-off. Oh, maybe a little too excited on the play. Yeah, that play happened so fast, James. I mean, I think it's a great scoring chance. He might have rushed it just a bit, thinking he's running out of time. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Slides it across to 
Horschel. Horschel moving it ahead. Moves it to Sutter. shake his head when he sees this because he's he's in as good a scoring spot as you're going to get to all night and he just misses the net in a head-to-head -head matchup tonight who had the better performance chick rings looking good even though he hasn't recorded a point guys i think he's stayed engaged and has stuck with it and that's why i'm giving him my vote for our matchup stop with ease Yeah. 